Hello. How are you doing, everyone? My name's Adati. I'm Lavinia with oh. a very huge smile today. It, well, that's good. It's good to smile. It is. Um, all right, so it's another Juicy Lady shot, and we have lots going on for you as per usual. Yes, we do. We have um, Sonny Badu, who's been getting a little bit dark on him. Going in. Also, we're going to be reviewing um, Willie McDowell concert that happened in Birmingham. Yep. Um, Darlene Check has got some new music out, so we're going to be sharing a bit about that. Um, another person going in is Juanita Byron. Oh. oh my god, wait till you hear what she has you to say about some of you Christian women in church. Also, um, the massive Tim Godfrey has got some new heat for us, so uh, we're going to be sharing that with you a little bit later on. But to kick us off right now is our track of the week, which is from UK based but kind of America based hip hop artist SO. This is a new track, it dropped on the 24th of February and it's called What Now? What now? He's married now, like, what now? Like, he's big in the game, so it's like, what? What now? What now? So, uh, so listen, if you want to hear this track and much more like it, then make sure that you tune into Vine Juice Radio, yeah. uh, which is on your screen right now. Uh, you can find it on TuneIn app or vinejuice.co.uk forward slash radio. Radio. All right. Early on in the week. We were all shocked to find out that Sonny Badu, one of the leading Ghanaian gospel artists, was in hospital. Oh, Sick! He was! Um, and so he posted this and, you know, all the sympathies came in. You know, oh, poor Sonny, I hope you're okay. But then, um, a couple of days after that, uh, some other posts came out that said that they could confirm that Sonny Badu had passed away. What? So sad, God bless his soul. Well, Sonny Badu was absolutely mortified. He was angry and he hit back at those people declaring and confirming that he was dead to say all bloggers with false information claiming they spoke to someone from our camp and put, and put confirmed have 30 minutes to take it off their site. Failure to do so will result in a lawsuit from which all proceeds will be given to orphans. And if that is your wish, within three weeks, may you experience what you typed. You don't see that his name is Badu. Embodious it, embodious it, darkness, darkness. Curses on you. You, don't you can't wish him dead. <laughs> he will wish it right back on you. And he puts a timeline on it. Three weeks. Go and tell your mother. Yeah. Go and tell your father. <laughs> and you know what's funny? Is that yeah. he's actually so nice. He's such a nice he's guy. Very mild mannered. Yeah. He's very calm. But if you cross him, he'll get badu on you. <laughs> badu, badu. <laughs> Okay, so we did come back a little bit later on to say, you know, to do a video thanking everybody for their prayers and to just double confirm in case you were still confused, he is absolutely yeah. fine and actually is um, sounding like he's got some new music and new projects coming up. Yes, alive and kicking. And also alive and kicking in Birmingham last weekend was William McDowell. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It was gosh. so good. Pastor William brought the rain so if you missed the concert where the heck were you it's been promoted for like a year and um they did well they filled the place it was about two and a half thousand worshippers that um was it that many yeah yeah that wow. descended upon the bethel we convention descended. center Landed. in birmingham Lord, we will Tonight. So we want you. Lord, we will wait for you. Because 
watched the rest of or the whole video of that particular song send the rain as he performed it then you need to go to the vine juice youtube channel it is there anyway let's move on yes can you say her name darling check darling check she said Shh, yes <laughs> that doesn't sound good <laughs> She is back and back with a vengeance. Yeah. So back in 2014, she got the scare that a lot of women, you know, don't want to receive, mm -hmm. and that is the news that she had been diagnosed with breast cancer. But praise the Lord through prayer and you know, just really seeking the Lord's face and good friends of hers like Martin Smith and her husband, of course, she's been able to pull through. She's now in remission, which is great. Praise the Lord. But what's also great is during that difficult time, she was able to do a whole album. Mm. So this album is about to drop on the 3rd of March. Which and is today? Is that today? Yeah! The album's dropping today, guys! It's dropped today! <laughs> Glory! And it's called, Here I Am, Send Me. You know that when somebody writes an album in the midst of their darkness, it's going to be powerful, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. So um, look out for that. Also, you can find out much more about that and see the video of one of the tracks that's on the album, You Are Great, on the set on <laughs> Vine Juice website. It's got some really big names on there, guys, yeah, yeah, as well. Yeah. So really go and check it out. Vinejuice.co.uk. <laughs> so, you know, we like Woo! to share with you things that are juicy, things that give us joke. Things that are convicting and things that are serious. And um, this is kind of all of that more than one. This is all of them <laughs> and a little bit more. So we need to mine them. What's her actual title? Like, isn't it Prophetess? Yeah, I think because they call her Prophetess. Prophetess, Apostle Anointed. Worshipping powerful woman of So God. you know this woman, right? She's really out there and she, she, she doesn't hold back, right? And on Facebook recently... She went absolutely oh my gosh. all the way in. All right, so let's not say anymore. Let's show you, and then we'll talk about we'll it. We'll show you. Yeah. And I can't even, I can't even get to the concept of somebody preaching and leading praise and worship with no stockings on, with thongy, stringy shoes on, and your legs all greased up. What kind of message are you trying to send us? Because to me, that looked like somebody that's got a whole spirit that ain't purged out in God and any minute you can just go over in a corner to a deacon and just raise your dress up and hit it right there in the corner because you don't even have drawers on. You got on thongs and some greasy legs and a bip bop skirt and you are our praise and worship leader? Somebody really got under with his skin. Now listen, I've got a confession. Because I'm a worship leader. And sometimes I lead worship. With a house any... spirit! <laughs> without, without any stockings on. And sometimes I have stringy, thongy oh, shoes. You stringy, thongy shoes with your dry toes out? Does that mean I have a whole spirit? That I would just get, she actually said, you can just go to the corner with the deacon and hit it. Because you have no drawers on. Juanita, what happened? I would, I, would, I would love to know what was behind that. Like, what did you see, Juanita, that led to that? <laughs> Talking about a whole spirit. <laughs> Leading worship with your whole spirit. Like, Do you know oh. what? People in the church would usually oh. try and tame that and say, you know, it's the spirit of Jezebel operating in the church not Anita. she's telling us it is it's a whole spirit the church requires dry legs girls nowadays yes. we want dry legged women yes. leading our worship do not yes. grease your legs yes we don't want no black and cracked toes <laughs> if you are a worship leader or a singer or a minister of any kind and your neckline sometimes gets a little low uh -oh. and your shoes get a little See me i've done it like, should, like right up here right up right up right up your shoes get a little stringy. Oh, we've got too much armor. Cover up, cover up, cover up. Listen, you need to go and repent of the whole spirit. <laughs> we need to run in. You know what? She's got a point, I'm sure. No, she but has. Because she, she when you watch the whole video, it does start with, you know, this whole thing of really low necklines. And she says, I can see the crack between your boobs. <laughs> so 
it's not. You okay. need to watch the whole thing. Go to yeah. brianjuice.co.uk Do that. A little bit later and you'll find it there. Yeah. <laughs> that really gave us joy. It is convicting. If that's you, fix up. All right, so finally, Tim Godfrey. Like, Tim Godfrey's huge. He's not the biggest guy, but he's a huge name. Yeah. And, and um, he needs to tell you that himself. That he's small. No, that, that he's huge. huge. Yes. Name. Yes. <laughs> oh, he dropped a new oh, video today. Yeah. And it's so good. Yeah. Dependable, dependable guy. you hop on over to vinejuice.co.uk uh -huh. where you can see a little bit about it and watch the video that's right if you are new to us make sure that you do follow us on this platform and all the other social media platforms that's twitter instagram and all that good stuff all under the name of vine juice vine juice and make sure that you go and hop on to vinejuice.co.uk to go and hear more about everything that we've talked about today and more juice from the urban Christian culture. Also, you will find Fine Juice Radio over there, which um, which you just need to make the playlist of your day. Right. 